Today we're going to look at the project uh, slope from a line to a different surface at a certain slope. So I have an example here from a customer. Now what I'm going to do, I'm going to make sure the line is set because it's very easy. So once I hit uh, edit, it's going to show me here that it's a set. And also I have uh, another line here which I want to do the projection for. So this is another and it's a set already so I'm cool there now I'm gonna go to my uh, Kogo street and slice in a plan view I'm gonna select my set I want to be projecting for the profile view I don't have to do it because it's a set hit settings now layer this is the layer where you want to project to so I'm gonna choose the original ground because that's what I want now, if I just only find it here real quick. Uh, oh, it was master or G. Okay, here. Okay. Now, begin station and end station. I mean, 10,000 meters should be enough to cover this. Station increment, I'm going to go, let's say, at 2 meters. Offset distance, I'm going to offset about 2-3 millimeters. So what it actually is going to do, it's going to create a 3 millimeter line off and then start my projection. Here we have a cuts and slope, so I have a 0 0.75 and 0 0.75, right? And I'm going to put the name of the point, I'm going to call them daylight. And I'll hit OK. Now. I need to set my layer, my current layer, to whatever layer I want to have this. So I'm going to call it day. OK. OK. OK, so I have the isolate on. So I'm just going to go back and I'm going to fix that real quick. Daylight, I believe. There you go. Okay. So now I have, if I hit OK, I have a new projected line at the certain slope, right? And it's a set. This is how you project the line at a certain um, slope to uh, existing ground, for example, existing uh, surface. Yeah, hope this helps to, for you guys. Thank you.